Chloe, welcome to Australia. Uh, you've just come off the back of the series against New Zealand. How did that go for you? Um, went really good. Um, took a lot of positives and negatives from it. And um, yeah, I'm just happy that we had a good series against them. Uh, I felt that we did really well in the ODIs. Um, so it's it's good that we got some T20 cricket just before the World Cup. Um, obviously got a bit of tweaking now and then with the, the batting and bowling, but I felt like we did really well there. Um, and um, just good that we got some time just before the World Cup. How are you feeling about your own form coming into such a big tournament? Um, up and down. Um, I felt like I played really good in different stages. Um, but yeah, I'm hoping that I can obviously tweak on that now. Um, so we got two warm games, so which is really good for me. But um, yeah, looking forward to just obviously getting out in the middle and getting some time. Oh yeah, so um, you know, looking ahead to the warm up games uh, coming up against Sri Lanka and Australia, what are you hoping to take from those as you open your campaign up against England? Oh, first of all, just getting some runs uh, would be really great for me. Um, but as a team, I just obviously feel like we just want to try and get everything together, um, batting, bowling and fielding. Um, just make sure that we, we're going into our first game against England um, very positive um, and, and obviously playing really good cricket. And, oh, when, uh, when it comes to acclimatising to conditions, of course, you've now played in New Zealand, but you guys have lost a few hours. How are the team feeling over the past 24 hours? Uh, not too bad. It was a lot of uh, travelling yesterday, um, but everyone looks like they're doing pretty well. Um, we're kind of used to it as well. Um, yeah, I know some of the girls also played in, Aus in Australia, so which is really good for us. Um, try to get that background and make sure when we go in the warm-up games, we make sure that we acclimatise as quick as possible to the conditions. Um, but yeah, everyone just looks really positive at the moment, looking forward to just kick-start the World Cup. Yeah, and you've also got a lot of WBBO experience in your team, which must also be another thing that's so helpful out here. Yeah, no, really good. Um, happy few players went went over there. Um, got a lot of knowledge. Um, lot, uh, obviously watched a lot of players as well, which is really good. Um, so yeah, it's a lot of information that has been given to the teams, which is really good. Um, so uh, it'll be really uh, good to to start off the the World Cup with England first, because <laughs> I love to play them. <laughs> And my last question, uh, the final set down for International Women's Day on March 8th, it would be the biggest Katy Perry concert in history. Do you, do you have a favourite song? Uh, no, I think everyone, uh, we like all their songs. Uh, Dane <laughs> is like uh, the biggest Katy Perry fan ever. So it would be great to get her on the stage. <laughs> um, but yeah, obviously it's, it's obviously a big day. Um, we're, hopefully we'll be on that stage with her. Awesome. Great answer. Thanks.